take you live to Ocean City, New Jersey with this storm in the forecast. There are major concerns over coastal erosion. Beaches along the Jersey Shore could see waves as high as 12 feet as our region braces for that storm system to move through this weekend. CBS Philadelphia's South Jersey reporter Brandon Golder is in Ocean City with why waves that big could be a big problem for shore towns. Last time Susan Van Doggen got to watch the waves crash onto Ocean City's beach was in August. There was enough beach for people to, you know, be out sunbathing and in the water and everything. The ocean looks like it's taken quite a chunk out of out of the beach. She fears a storm system forecasted to wash over our region this weekend could take an even bigger chunk out of the beach. If it's this bad right now, I'm pretty concerned after another bad storm comes. I've been following the storms all fall and they seem to be getting really slammed. Stockton University's Coastal Research Center's Kim McKenna says this weekend storm could produce 12 foot waves in some areas. Those 12 foot waves battering the, the um, shoreline right now could be an issue and maybe we could see some breaching of some dunes. Um, certainly we'll see some dune erosion. She says these dunes are important because they protect homes, businesses and roadways from being flooded by waves. We do need to keep an eye on um, you know, the coast and then the, the municipalities need to be ready for uh, initial impacts. Professor McKenna says it's not just the dunes in Ocean City that could be affected by this weekend's storms. It also could affect places in Avalon and North Wildwood. Meantime, while the weather remains nice, Van Doggen says she's going to enjoy watching the waves. I just really miss the ocean. Um, the light here is different, the smell is different. I just always get, you know, re revived after I come here. She hopes the beach will get revived after this weekend's storm passes through. Brandon Goldner, CBS News, Philadelphia.